low 4 4 area, so I feel like I went out there and I did what I had to do. Um, during the process, like how many teams have you heard from so far? Um, I would say about I would say about uh, ten teams, yeah, about ten teams. So uh, you know, it's been it's been like a few days. I'll have like a few interviews, but it's been slow throughout. But um, I'm hoping that it'll pick up after today. For sure, for sure. But like you know, teams if they if they look at your you know film, they'll know you play both safety positions. Mm -hmm. And the speed that you showed today. Um, how much of a feather under your cap that you like, hey, I, I can play both safety positions mm -hmm. and you know I'm running. Uh, yeah, I, I just I, I feel like uh, that showed you know that my film you know it, it won't lie, but those numbers uh, I feel like it boosted me. You know, it showed that I can play all over the field, and you know even if they need to play a little nickel and dime, you know, I can get in there. So you gonna go back to old high school? Oh yeah, for sure, man. Hey, defensive back, not even a safety no more. Right. So. Um, just about your training, man. You were in Florida. How long were you there, you know, getting the prep work for today? Man, I literally, I flew out um, two days after the game. So on the third, I was out. Um, I was ready to put that work in, you know. And uh, I grinded. I was down there for about, I want to say, 10, 10 plus weeks. So um, I was down there, you know, with Matt Gates and Tony Villiani. I call them the gurus, you know. They got, hey, they, they do great work down there, man. The treadmill, hey, but, uh, yeah, they, they got me right now. I was down there for about 10 weeks. Besides the numbers that you just put up, like, what do you want to tell teams that are looking to draft the Um, I want to tell teams that, um, you know, that speed is there, but my hard work and my leadership is uh, it's more important than that speed. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you.